Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to bring you through the lower body workout I did the other day. So as always, if you're new here and if you're unaware, also, okay, wait, the Lululemon logo not being center on my head is driving me nuts. Anyways, I know that was really random, but anyways, all of my workouts always start out with a 10 to 15 minute incline walk on the treadmill. I just think it's a great way to get your um, get your blood moving, get your heart rate up a little bit, and just get nice and warmed up, especially with the colder months coming around if you live in Canada, like I do, unfortunately. Winter is approaching. Winter is quickly approaching. So we wanna make sure those muscles are nice and warmed up and ready to go. With that being said, I am super, super sorry, but I forgot to record my mobility warm up, but it is not looking very different from my other ones. So, if you are super curious about what my mobility warm up includes, just click on like almost any other of my workout videos, and you will see almost all my workout videos start the same with that 10 to 15 minute incline walk on the treadmill, and then some leg swings, some body weight squats, and just getting my body ready to go into these working sets. But I started out with some box squats. This has really been helping me continue doing squats throughout my pregnancy because I've had really bad low back pain. So adding in the bench just takes a lot of pressure off of my low back once you hit that parallel mark. Um, so I sit back onto the bench and then stand back up from that. I have been noticing I can still really feel my quads working a lot and my glutes working a lot um so yeah if you have a bad low back or if you're pregnant like i am try incorporating a bench or a box now i am so upset it took me eight months of my pregnancy to work up the courage to try these hip thrusts on the smith machine but i wish i've been doing it this entire time i could have had the most glorious bubble booty ever by <laughs> by this point if i stuck and did those for eight months consistent consistently but i was a little afraid to try them but honestly the bar just sits on my thighs and i get a lot more hamstring engagement than glutes i still hit that under part of my glutes but it's more hamstrings because i'm loading the weight directly on top of my thigh so it's a little less glute, a little more hamstring, but I just want to make sure I'm keeping that bar nice and far away from my uh, lower abdomen. I superseded those with body weight lunges. Lunges has been something I have really been struggling with during this pregnancy. I cannot add weight to them. Any single leg exercise um, just it feels like it makes my pelvis uneven and I'm carrying this baby very low, so it's just super uncomfortable. I ended my workout out with these preloaded barbell RDLs and then superseted it with kettlebell swings. And honestly, this superset was targeting my glutes and it felt great. It was hitting all the muscles that I wanted it to hit and it was the perfect way to end off my lower body workout. So my workouts are looking a lot less intense than they were a couple months ago. I am nearing the ninth month of my pregnancy. So I'm in the last week of my eighth month. So I am basically full term. Um, so no wonder I'm slowing down a little bit. Um, I'm not hitting the gym as often as I, as I was a couple months ago. So I'm probably going to the gym about four times a week now and probably just walking on those other days. But I'm super happy and proud of myself for making it this far and staying active and healthy for this long. Um, I ended my workout off with a nice slow stretching routine and I focused on stretching out my glutes, my lower back, and my hips because that has been, all three of those things have been the trifecta for <laughs> just really, really irritating me and giving me a hard time during this pregnancy. My hips, they just, they're, they're gone. <laughs> so I focused on those, but that was it for my workout. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you all in the next one.